Goblin Shark The Deep Sea's Spring-Loaded Nightmare In the Midnight Zone, a pale shape drifts like a ghost. Then you see it, the blade-flat snout, needle teeth, and skin so pink it looks bloodlit. Meet the Goblin Shark, a living fossil from a family that's prowled the depths for over a hundred million years. It's built for ambush, small eyes, flabby body, oily liver for near-neutral buoyancy. So it hovers in the dark and wastes almost no energy. But the real jump scare is its mouth. When prey wanders close, the jaws rocket forward in a slingshot strike, launching at over three meters per second far more protrusible than other sharks. It's like the face itself snaps off to grab dinner. Nature, targets, deep sea fishes, squid, and crustaceans. Those spring-loaded jaws and the snout, S electroreceptors let it detect faint bioelectric signals and snatch life out of black water, keeping mid-depth prey populations in check in a food web, right, re-only beginning to map. You'll almost never meet one. Goblin sharks roam continental slopes and canyons, typically hundreds to over a thousand meters down, a world utterly inhospitable to us. Global but deep, they surface rarely. But do they attack humans? Short answer, no confirmed attacks and zero fatal records. They seldom encounter people, and while any big shark could injure, goblin sharks are not considered a danger to us. So remember this paradox of the deep. A pink, ghostly shark whose spring-loaded jaws can terrify on sight. Yet it spends its life balancing the deep sea ecosystem far below the reach of daylight. And us love strange creatures with nightmare looks and genius design. Like, comment and subscribe.